we're here to celebrate the second year of supporting young Kenyan talent. With the help of the government led by His Excellency the President of the Republic of Kenya, who is also the patron of the rally, we were able to pull through and indeed the rally was voted one of the most followed rallies in the World Rally Championship. First time in a rally car, my first time doing a rally, my first time sitting with a navigator. So everything was new. So I took it as a learning experience. For me, it means opportunity. And if you look in the case of the cars, we've been privileged to get and the opportunity that it's giving young drivers this opportunity that wasn't there and shifting the narrative that the sport is only reserved for old, rich people. Um, we're really looking forward uh, to actually everything you've given not just us but you've given Kenya the chance to strive for excellence and we're very thankful to Safaricom. Um, I did the rally of Sweden, uh, I finished fourth in my class. Uh, it was the first African to ever finish in a snow event. Our sponsorship is uh, for these young rally drivers that you've seen uh, in front of us and they're supporting teams and officials to travel to competitions in Africa and in Europe over the next three years. We have challenges of uh, what uh, the youth do every day uh, uh, these days. I think it is important that uh, we ensure that uh, our young people are really seeing sports as something that inspires them uh, to focus their energy. The sponsorships that we continue to receive, and especially the critical ones that we are receiving today, are very, very important. They're important in ensuring uh, that the drivers participate uh, in all these events, the Safari Rally, but other local and international events.